What's up guys? So today is the day. Finally got the hair reveal coming. Alright, so I have to say I'm kind of nervous uh, showing it. It looks like crap. If you haven't uh, seen the old video, uh, I made a promise to not cut my hair or shave my head, which I'm used to doing, uh, until I get down below 300 pounds. Alright, so it's a big motivator to lose more weight. And I have to say it sucked. It's horrible having hair when you're balding because I don't have a big head of hair. It looks horrible, it just looks like an old man. So, here's the, the big reveal. And I realize that I'm, I'm filming this early on April 1st, so a lot of people are gonna think this is an April Fool's Day joke, which is funny, um, but it's not. So, here we go. The big hair reveal. So I'm just gonna, I don't know, should I peel it slow or just rip it off like a Band-Aid? I don't know, I guess, I guess I'll just rip it off, all right? So, we'll do a countdown. From five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> oh, I hate doing that, but I do it every year, don't I? That's right, sorry. It's an April Fool's Day joke. Uh, I had to actually mention April Fool's just to, just for the people who know, people who have followed my channel and expect a joke today. Um, you know, I, I tried to throw you off there. Hopefully it worked. Uh, it's all in fun, but really the joke's on me because I am not yet under 300 pounds. I'm certainly on the way, just like everyone's weight loss journey. It, it's up and down, up and down. Uh, I probably lost about 25 pounds since I first uh, made that video uh, saying that I wasn't going to cut my hair. And I will tell you, I'll give you a little sneak peek, just, you know, to be fair, I have hair. I have, <laughs> I have a horrible, horrible haircut right now because there's no cut. It's just bald in the middle and it's like, I, I got gray hair coming in. It is bad. And I absolutely will have a hair reveal video but I don't want to cheat, I don't want to lie, I always keep it real with you guys, so I have to get under 300 pounds before I can actually show you. And then of course I can shave it, uh, but I'll tell you what, I am extra motivated now because it's starting to get nice out, and I am not gonna go through spring and certainly summer uh, with this hair. It is ridiculous. Um, if you guys watch <laughs> 90 Day Fiance, there's like a million versions of 90 Day Fiance shows. I, I wanna say it's like before the 90 days maybe, there's a guy, Gino, who always wears his hat. He won't take his hat off. That's how I feel right now. You know, when I'm in public, I wear a hat. Uh, there was one day where it was like 70 degrees, and I wanted to take my hat off. My head was sweating from my hair, and I'm like, this is just horrible. Uh, so it's still very much working as a motivator. I am very much going to keep my promise. That's the, that's the biggest thing here is uh, it's easy to just throw in the towel and be like, ah, forget it. I'm just going to shave my head. But I'm not like that. I'm a man of my word, and I will absolutely keep my promise as, as much as it sucks, and that's the whole point of it. It sucks, I feel stupid, I look stupid, um, and so now I really have to lose the weight, and it's going to happen. So, hopefully sooner than later, but keep an eye out. I'm sorry to have disappointed people. I know you're excited about it. Some people can't wait to see what it looks like. Some people are just kind of curious. Um, it looks bad. It looks really, really bad. Trust me. Um, but you won't have to trust me. You'll actually get to see it, hopefully soon. So that's pretty much it. Sorry to uh, have, you know, ruined your day if you really thought you were going to see my horrible hair today. Uh, but hang in there. You will definitely see it uh, coming in the future. I did have a couple different uh, video ideas for April Fool's Day. I, I thought of some knife-related things, but I've done a lot over the years. I've done a lot of April Fool's Day jokes. Um, one of the uh, ideas I had was I was going to do another video... If you guys remember when I uh, was driving and I was talking about how I don't break the law because I drive the speed limit. Well, in reality, I go about five miles an hour over pretty much everywhere I go because driving the speed limit can actually be dangerous on the highway. Um, but I thought it'd be kind of funny because so many people hated on that video and hated the idea that I was filming with my phone. Oh, man. Which is, by the way, legal. It's totally fine to film with your phone. You just can't text when you're driving. Um, but that's not really the point. The point was... Uh, they just didn't like the fact that I was basically causing more trouble by going the speed limit. It's unfortunate, but that's just how it works. You can't drive the speed limit safely. You just can't. Uh, and I don't. Like I said, I drive about five over pretty much everywhere I go. For 65 on the highway, I'm driving 70 on cruise control in the slow lane like a schmo. 
Um, but, you know, I do want to avoid tickets and, you know, avoid accidents and stuff like that. So I try to stay away from all the people who are rushing back and forth to work. But anyway, I thought it'd be funny if I did a video speeding and, and you know, filming, trying to find my own car or something similar to it and making a joke like I was someone else filming me. I'd be like, oh, look at this fat idiot, you know, filming on his phone, driving 50 miles an hour on the highway. And then it dawned on me that people would just give me uh, flack for actually speeding because that's what I wanted to do for the video to make it funny. So anyway, that was the uh, unsafe idea that I nixed. And, uh, and this was the, the second best idea, I guess, for, for April Fool's. So like I said, I mean, the joke really is on me for now because I haven't pushed it. Uh, but it's, it's happening. It's getting nice out. I refuse to walk around with a friggin' hat. So it's time. It's time to really, uh, you know, hit the, hit the ground running and, and start, uh, losing some more pounds. Like I said, I've been doing really good eating. I just, I'm not moving enough. I'm not exercising enough. Uh, and recently I threw my, my arm out, my shoulder. It's not really my shoulder. It's the muscle. I, I must have tore the muscle. It is excruciatingly painful. Um, not to get all into it, but I was doing something physical. I was helping my, my dad with the project. He's putting in some uh, handrails in the house, and I, I feel like I, I stretched it, and then I didn't really let it heal. I was doing other projects, and then I was moving a really heavy uh, filing cabinet, and then I heard it again, and then, you know, with one of the snowstorms, throwing snow and stuff, I heard it again. So I kept re-injuring the same muscle, and I must have tore it because it was, I mean, I'm going like probably a week and a half now, and I can't actually put my arm all the way up. It is very painful. Um, it's getting better every day. I have a little bit more movement, but it is just, it sucks because I can't sleep. I can't, I sleep on my side and I kind of toss and turn a little bit and I just cannot get comfortable. So I'm a walking zombie, you know, running on three, four hours of sleep every night. But anyway, uh, it's not a boohoo for me video. Uh, I'll heal. I'll be fine. But, uh, but yeah, I did want to say that um, for the people who actually are interested in seeing my ridiculous hair, you will see it and I will actually lose the weight because I will keep my word. Uh, that was the point of doing it, is uh, holding myself responsible here on the internet, you know, for a bunch of people to be like, hey, what the hell, Jeff, you got to do it. So I will. I'll do it. But anyway, it is a new month, uh, and the weather is getting nicer here in the uh, northeast uh, of the United States, and uh, hopefully everyone's doing all right. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful uh, April Fool's Day, and I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.